So this is a motherboard review. And if you order a motherboard set, this will be inside the packaging. You'll see that there's four parts. So you have the motherboard and you have a um, compatibility box and a <clears throat> wiring cable with a programming cable. So with our programming cables, you can actually adjust the maximum speed and also the acceleration strength for your scooter. So it can fit your needs. Let's say you buy one of our motherboards, but you don't want it to go 65. Let's say you want it to go 50 or maybe 40 or 35. Whatever you want, you can just hook it up into the computer and start programming it and adjust the speed to your own liking. Not only will we give you the correct software, but we will also send you detailed instructions on how to program the motherboard and also a programming video. The nice thing about the fact that our motherboards are programmable is that it's actually cross-compatible across different scooter models. So you see our motherboards, they're physically larger in size than the original motherboard, and this is because they allow for more ampere, so you can get a higher maximum speed and also more acceleration. And then we have a compatibility box to make it compatible with the scooter. This compatibility box is cross-compatible across different scooter models. So let's say you have an M Plus and you're switching over to a UQI, you can still use the same motherboard. This motherboard will actually also even fit a N1S, but I would recommend getting the larger size motherboard, which I'll show in a second, because there's more power in the N1S than 65. So this is the size for a um, <clears throat> 65 kilometer an hour motherboard. And this is the size for a motherboard that's, for the N1S, it's around 70 kilometers on the road, but free spin, it will be around 120. So this means that for this motherboard, the speed will be unrestricted to about 65 kilometers an hour, meaning that if you were to drive on the road, it will accelerate up to around 60. And for this motherboard, which we mainly provide for the M1S because for the UQI and M plus, it's not gonna fit physically. This motherboard goes around 75 kilometers an hour on road to 70 and the free speed, the free spin speed is 120 kilometers unrestricted. And you can see that there's notice, noticeable size difference between the two motherboards. You'll see that there's a connected cable and one half of the side has a black USB head. So if you would install this, you have to stick this side with the black head into the motherboard first. So you just stick it in. There's only one direction. After you stick it in like that, you'll see that this USB adapter can just be connected like this, and then you can just plug it into your computer. with the USB. Then we take our black box and you'll see that there's two sides. One that says KZQ, which stands for motherboard, and one that says car. The car side will go into your scooter cable, will also look like this, and the scooter cable side will have to go into the car side. So you take this side with the KZQ and you connect it to this side. After you connect the other side to the KZQ side, you'll see that there's a final side, which has car, and there, there goes your original scooter cable. Then you just have to put the five colored screws in and you'll be done. And also the four screws that secure the motherboard. But only two will fit, but two is totally fine. If you wanna hear more about the instructions of how to install the motherboard, we have a dedicated installation page and also for our customers, we provide live chat customer service. We also provide email customer service, WhatsApp, Instagram, 
So there's many ways to contact us and we'll reply to you as quick as possible if there are any questions. But the instructions should be very clear on how to install it. And it shouldn't take you longer than about 30 minutes. So if you would like to order our motherboards, you can find them at eschoolparts.com. We ship worldwide for free. And if you have a UQI, a U1, an M+, then you pick this motherboard. And if you have an M1S, then you pick the larger motherboard, this one. And if you have an NGT, MGT, or M Pro, then we have a software service. The only upgrade we have available is that you have to send in your motherboard and we program it for you and we send it back. If after buying a motherboard, you want even more speed or more acceleration, then you can go for one of our battery upgrades. And with our battery upgrades, because there are three components into making your scooter faster. So you have your motherboard, which regulates the amount of ampere flow, but you also have a battery, which regulates the amount of input you can have as in your capacity for going faster. So after you get a motherboard, the speed should be significantly faster, but let's say it's not enough for you. You can just get a battery, a battery upgrade. And with the battery upgrade, your scooter will go even faster because there's more ampere flow than with your original scooter battery. If you wanna get one of our batteries, it's also on eschoolparts.com.